Hello, one and all. Um, I'm going to touch up on a video I made uh, very, very recently. Um, I, if you haven't seen the videos about Mouse Utopia or quote unquote Universe 25, go look them up. Not my videos, mind you, but some other people's videos. There's more of them than you could ever imagine. They basically create a unit utopia for mice, and long story short, it imploded. This experiment was done very consistently, and uh, it all and they all yielded the same results. That being said, is um, it makes you wonder: Are we headed in the same direction? Because does technology plus comfort minus social interaction equal the downfall of humanity? Well, let's talk about this. Okay, um, the thing pe most people don't get, get about evolution is it does not favor survivability. It favors reproductive success, meaning that if uh, a Darwin Award winner manages to have, like, ten kids, his genes will still live on, or in some cases her genes will live on. That being said, is, um, you know, a person who is a super achiever but has no kids, their genes will not live on. The um, Darwin Awards kind of got that wrong. It's not about survivability. It's reproductive success. Because if the recipient has already had kids, then it's kind of too late to eliminate them from gene pool, assuming their kids also don't, don't get eliminated before they reproduce. That being said is, um, if you look at, like, feminism, MGTOW, herbivore men, and all that stuff, is the birth rates are going down, way down in industrialized nations. And, uh, in these places, um, we live in relative comfort. I mean, a person this in this day and age, the average person, even if they live below the poverty line, they still live a lot better than a king did, um, you know, 200, 300, 500, 1,000 years ago, 3,000 years ago. You get the picture. Yeah, I mean, it's like, you know, even a king had to go to the bathroom in a pot. Even they didn't get running water. Even they um, didn't get hot water. They didn't have Wi-Fi. They didn't have phone, cell phones. They didn't have uh, frickin' TVs or uh, video games or any of that jazz. And, um, but the thing is, is that it's like, you know, um, with gender roles becoming less and less easier to define, a lot of people are just checking out of dating, both male and female, and saying, eh, I'm not going to do this. I'm just going to look at porn or reread Fifty Shades of Grey again, or something like that, or watch Twilight over and over and over. But, um, anyway, as far as the mouse utopia went, eventually the mice just stopped breeding and went extinct. They all died out. And I wonder if that is where we are headed. You know? Because um, it's like, you know, technology could be the end of us. And I don't mean that in like some way, like in the Matrix or in uh, Terminator or something like that, but we just gradually stop having sex and thus stop reproducing. I mean, there's abortion on demand in every Western country. And uh, even though Roe v. Wade was overturned, a woman just has to travel to another state to get one. It, um, and uh, not to mention we have birth control on demand and all that stuff. And hell, you don't even really have to have sex anymore. You can just go online and look at porn. And um, with us becoming more and more reliant on technology, 
you don't need kids to help around the farm anymore. Um, it, it, children increasingly become more of a liability than an asset. And um, it's just, you know, I'm really, I've really put a lot of thought into this. But the thing is, is as I said before, this, it, this, all this, I know there's just a lot of nature and shit behind me, but look around you. You're probably in your house right now and, uh, or in your room or whatever, and you live in heaven, you know? And, um, it's just, when you look at a utopian world, there's always a catch, even in fiction. I mean, look at the trailer for The Purge. It's like, unemployment's at an all-time low, crime's at an all-time low, everybody's making a huge bunch of money, but there's just a catch. For one night, for 12 hours, every crime, including murder, is legal. Now, our humanity's demise may not be as dramatic as we predicted, but it may be imminent. And I would just like to touch upon that. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed this video. Be sure to like, comment, share, and subscribe. Be good, y'all. Peace.